Hello, beautiful. I can't even express how much I love matcha. Like I had to cut back because it was getting too much. And I only like oat milk with my matcha lattes and I'm trying to get my summer bod ready and it's not good for that. Oat milk is has a lot of calories. Anyways, um, thank you for being here. We're gonna watch some people cut their bangs. And with bang cutting comes bang disasters. It seems like one of the easier things to do, but that's, I mean, I am a hairdresser, so I guess I can't say that about anything because I'm, I'm trained to do these things, but I don't know. Cutting a bang, it doesn't seem that difficult, but somehow people just end up absolutely demolishing their hair. I'm sure we're going to see a lot of that today. But first, thank you to BetterHelp for sponsoring today's Hair Just Reacts video. Y'all are the real ones. If you know me, you know I love some therapy. I love letting on my feelings to a stranger because there's a lot going on in this mind. I feel like when you're a creative person like I am, there's just a lot going on in here all the time. I need somebody to help me sort through it all. And it really helps just talking about it and going to a therapist. And did you know that BetterHelp is the world's largest therapy service? Service, and it is 100% online, which I love because I don't want to leave my house unless I have to. I like just wearing like PJs and looking like shit on my days off. With BetterHelp, you can tap into a network of over 30,000 licensed and professional therapists that can help you with a wide range of issues. To get started, you just answer a few questions about your needs and preferences in therapy. That way, BetterHelp can match you with the right therapist from their network. Then you can talk to a therapist however you feel comfortable, whether it's via text, chat, phone, or video call. I'm a video call type of gal. You can message your therapist at any time and schedule live sessions when it's convenient for you. If your therapist ends up not being the right therapist for you, you can switch to a new one at any time with no extra fee. With BetterHelp, you also get a therapist that is selected just for you and your needs. Also, it's a lot more flexible and it comes at a more affordable price. So get 10% off of your first month at betterhelp.com backslash bradmondo. That's betterhelp.com backslash bradmondo. That is also linked below in the description. So just Click it. All right, let's watch some people demolish their bangs and completely regret it. Ah, thank God I have therapy. <laughs> let's get into this. <laughs> let's watch them. I'm really afraid because I think I've tried this like three times before and I like messed up every time, but this time I'm determined to get it right. We've done it three motherfuckers times three and she said she failed every single time what is it that makes you think that the fourth time is a charm the saying is third time's a charm not fourth time babe put the shears away put it down go see a professional i don't know and if you're doing it again i, I hope you watched like a lot of tutorials and really took some thorough notes but let's see what happens i'm determined to do it right this time Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Not the cough laugh already coming up. Oh my god. Why did you cut it like that? Why did you just what was the technique? What was the thought behind that? I mean, looking into your eyes, it seems like there was no thought behind it, but why did we just the huh? And we didn't even the huh or like cross things over or turn. Start off long too. We already went too short. Start off long when you're doing bangs. <clears throat> oh my god. This is really where we're starting this video today. <laughs> Horrible. These could not have come out any worse. Why are they so short? And don't style them like that. I think you put a little bit too much of a bevel in the bangs where they are just now like really propped up. Let's see the ending of this video. 10 minutes after the disaster. Um, I've decided that my only way out is that tomorrow I'm gonna go to the hairdresser and I will ask for baby bangs. I'm gonna have to do it. Audrey Hepburn style? <clears throat> Oh my 
god. Okay, um, to the hairdresser who has to do that, to who has to fix that situation. Good luck. First of all, when you're cutting your own bangs, you should probably wet them. If you have like a super defined part in your hair and you're cutting bangs and they're going to the side, you're not gonna get a precise cut. Let's put a lot of water in the hair and then blow dry. Once it's blow dried and you see the actual height of your bangs, we can then go shorter, you know, and then refine. Let's work our way up though. Let's not do it all at once. Don't do that. Don't do anything she did actually. That was all around bad. Actually, every single part of it was terrible. <laughs> hey bitch, it's that time of the month again. And no, not that time of the month. Who are you calling a bitch? Come here. Who are you calling a bitch? So if you guys remembered, I fried my hair like, I don't know how long ago, but I accidentally like, fried the front piece of my hair off. Um. <laughs> Be for real. Oh, 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 it is fried. It is a good two inches. That's a problem. I'm glad she's cutting bangs to kind of conceal that little two inch in there. It's looking a little spooky. Let's see what she can do with it though. And probably nothing great. And I was like thinking of like ways to make the front of my hair a little healthier, like these kind of pieces, because they're so fried. So I've been looking into like doing like wispy bangs, because I don't know how I would look with like full on bangs. You know what I mean? So what are we going to do? We're going to cut some wispy bangs. Mm, it's a wispy bang. It's like like a wispy bang, like a wispy anime. Send it, girl. I don't know if I should encourage her, actually. It's probably gonna f actually ruin her hair. So what I'm gonna be using to cut my hair is literally like so dumb because I forgot all my scissors at work. So <laughs> we're using these. Some thinning shears to thin it out if it looks weird. Were those like eyebrow scissors? Like what were those? Just a comb and a spray bottle. So this is the parting that I did. I had my hair parted down the middle and then I'm doing like a triangle kind of part. But I'm gonna do them starting off this thick. It's probably gonna be too thick, but I'll thin it out, whatever. I really don't know too much about cutting bangs. That actually looks like phenomenal sectioning. I'm impressed. Press. That looks very clean and very precise and very correct. So good job with that. We're starting off good. So I'm just going to start by getting my spray bottle and just wetting them down. I'm going to start off by getting a little piece from this side here in the front and then from this side. So this is going to be like my guide piece. I'm going to start off by cutting like little, look, see this is my broken piece. It's pretty long. So it's like long enough to cut. So that's why I kind of wanted to wait also, but I'm going to start by cutting it at my nose. So far, so good. I like the fact that she's starting off at her nose. That's very long. And you know, when the hair is dried, it's going to decrease in length. So that'll probably end up a little bit farther up like right around here which is a great length for some wispy bangs and then when i dry it i'll go a little shorter because i'm like scared so that's how much i'm gonna cut off for now i'm gonna literally kind of cut this like a curtain bang oh so she's got the technique going on where are we gonna go wrong here though it's feeling like she's going to do a very good job i'm gonna kind of diagonal my fingers and just point chop this off <laughs> Did I fuck up? Probably. <laughs> what the f just happened? Why did she do it like that? I feel like she was doing so good and then all of a sudden we just like cut a random length. Like the first piece was down here and the second piece was up here. Now she has like this weird ladder going. I don't know what the f did anybody just see that? Like, I'm just repeating what I did on the other side, like kind of diagonal and then going to cut like, you know, on an angle. Here's what they're looking like for now. I'm kind of scared. How did they get that short? What just happened? So I'm going to blow it out because I don't have enough time and then I'll be back. I'm like with them, but they're a little like too thick. So I'm going to like thin them. So I'm just going to grab sections like this and go up and like grab the thinning shear and thin them. Oh, <laughs> with the thinning shears. It was like good, decent, bad, really f bad. Just so quick, just so quick. I did not see that one coming. She literally used the thinning shears as scissors. I mean, they're scissors, but like she actually cut all the length off instead of just thinning them. A disaster. So I definitely cut them way too short and way too thick. I look like I have a f I don't know, shrub on my head. I fucked up, but have a good night. Oh, not my favorite bang on you. We could probably save this, you know? We could let down a little bit more hair, make them a little thicker, cut the next pieces a little bit longer, do a little wispy blow dry away from the face, and we could solve the issue. But that was not the right technique at all. You were on to something, but then you just completely lost it at the end. I don't know where you were going with that. What the f-
What? 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 Where did the gardening shears come from? Can we watch that again? Actually, I don't know what those are. Just giant scissors. Listen, they got the job done. <laughs> I mean, those are some full bangs. Those are some bangy, bang alicious bangers. She's banged out. Like, whoa. That is some Nicki Minaj bang. Um, not my thing, but she definitely has bangs. And they're not too short. They might be too thick and might be too wide, but I don't even know what she was cutting with. I'm impressed. I'm impressed that we even got a straight cut there. I mean, what the fuck? were those and why am i intrigued like why do i want a pair those look like they weigh 20 pounds and she's going off she's like i got this sit down and let's cut them and she went right across those big things i can't tell if i hated this or loved it something i felt some way inside my body um and that girl getting her hair cut was very trusting it seemed to be her mother cutting the bangs and she was just like go off sis cut them however you want give me a bang Give me a full bang. And she was like, I got you, sweetheart. I got you. <laughs> she didn't got you. I don't know if it was the best. Le voy a cortar. Ay, no veo, chicas. Es que saben que no veo y me da miedo. La monza en sus momentos más esquizofrénicos. ¿Por qué? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't cut it. <laughs> Please don't cut that. Don't cut it. Don't do it. Why are you up so high? It is way too short. Just don't do it that short. Go down to your nose. Why are we all the way up here? She did a good job with the technique. She like turned the hair a couple times, twisted it. That way she gets like a bevel at the ends, but oh, that is way too short. <laughs> ¿Qué estoy haciendo? <gasps> Do estoy siendo, or whatever she said. Don't do it. No puedo creer que lo hice. Ya. A ver, vamos a ver cómo nos quedó. Ay, Dios, estoy temblando. No, 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 no. Me voy a peinar para ver. Dice, bájalo más, se va a arrepentir. ¿Qué hiciste, me voy a hacer copete, pero me voy a ver bonita. ¿no? A ver. ¿Eh? A ver. ¿Qué? No, ve, pues me voy a peinar a pena. No. ¿Qué? Uy. ¡No! No, güey. That was one of the most crazy bang fails I've seen in a long time. What did you even think was gonna happen? Why did you do it like that? Why did you cut him so short? Oh my god. Dude, they're like one inch long. Where was the logic? What was the reasoning? I need to know. I wish I knew Spanish. I want to know what she's saying. Dude, that's fucking terrible. What happened? Oh. Oh my god. Um, she had the right idea and the right technique in the beginning, but the execution just... That's a big theme in today's video. Just execution just down the drain. Technique up here. You know, it's like a roller coaster I'm going on today. Oh my god. Don't ever do that again. <laughs> I hope they grew out. I hope you're okay. I hope you're mentally stable. Because that was traumatizing even for me to watch. Well, I have a history of making some bad impulsive decisions when it comes to my hair. And I've got to stay on brand. So today we're going to cut some bangs on my very curly hair. I'm just going to take a really small amount off. I don't even have hair scissors. Oh, I've made a really bad decision. Yes, you are right. You are making a very, very bad decision. You can always tell when it's gonna go bad when they start off with just a straight across cut. Don't freaking do that, dude. Don't do a straight across cut. It doesn't work out. Nobody wants a straight across bang these days, you know? No, it doesn't look good on anybody. It's not gonna complement your face shape. You gotta work on one side, then the other. You gotta do a little bevel, no matter what. Unless you're going for like a baby bang. It's just not a good idea to do a straight across cut because it just completely doesn't blend it with the rest of your hair. You have a, a shelf and then another shelf it's not flattering this was not a good decision why did i just do that I'm gonna need to carry on now those are the smallest little tiniest little scissors ever what are those gonna do for you there's really no excuse to not have hair cutting shears because they have them at like the dollar store i'm pretty sure and they're fine for a one-time use i never personally actually used them from a dollar store but i'm sure they're fine for a one-time use these are not made for cutting hair it's gonna make the job basically impossible oh 
I look like the little lad. Will you guys please put water in your hair and comb out the part from your hair, please, before cutting your bangs, please? That's it. That's all I need you to do. And a list of uh, like 25 other things. But that is the main thing. Berries and cream, berries. Shit, 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 shit on it. Maybe I should just stop. That would be a great idea. Just stop. Just don't do anymore. But something tells me she's going to keep going. It's definitely giving Will bias. That's sure. Um, however, obviously it's not going to look like that because it's going to be styled. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to wet it and let it naturally dry and see if it looks as... Oh god. Okay, it might be cute. Oh, I mean, it could be fine. Not obsessed. We need to blend with the rest of the hair. It's looking like a shelf. I don't know. With the curly hair too, you gotta make sure you cut it really long or else they're gonna bounce way up. Like her hair is not even fully curled right now. Those are gonna be above her eyebrows when it's curly and she's gonna be like, Sh I wish I didn't do that. Start off really long and work your way up and also dry your hair before you do the final cuts on the bangs, okay? Cut it long, let it dry, do another cut if it's too long. That is my main advice for today for all of you. Oh no! <laughs> Why do, stop it, stop it. Don't put tension on the hair. You're pulling the hair out of the place it lives, you know, and your hair lives in a certain spot when it's dry. So when you pull it out of the spot where it lives, it's gonna pop back up in weird directions and go in all different places and it's not gonna look right. That was the first thing she did wrong. And then the second thing she did wrong was just chop Rooney straight across. And then also she backed out. She did half of it straight across and the other half, she kind of just like let it do its own thing. I don't know. And then it was straight across and it went down. Terrible. Fixable, but not good by any means. Don't do that. Wait, what is this parting? What is going on? It's like a and it's like two little pieces of hair. We twisted it a thousand times. Just twist it once if you want a little bevel on the sides. Twisting it a bunch of times is gonna make it all weird. Why are you so far up? Do you want baby bangs? I don't think you do. Why are you all the way up here? If you want to be down here, what are we doing up here? What the hell? <laughs> I don't know how many more of these I can, I can watch today. I have stomach pains that are starting to come through because of how painfully awful these have been. <laughs> I have nothing more to say. I've already said I've already said so much, you guys. I don't I don't even think I have anything to say this one. Just <gasps> why? Why are we doing the absolute most, 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 most? What is this thing we got going on? What? <laughs> what is that? Fun to watch, but I don't know. And it's getting very thick. We're doing another section. She already did a lot of hair, and now she's doing a whole bunch more. going downwards when she cuts. I don't know if that's on purpose, but it's, it's looking a little crazy. Okay, when you do your thinning shears, don't start at the root like that because you're gonna end up with little baby hairs that are a half inch long that are gonna be pushing out everywhere looking like you have breakage. Don't do that. Do that towards the ends of the hair, the very ends. The technique was horrible. The end was a minor slay. I'm gonna end it there because I just want to end on a decently positive note. Those weren't the worst bangs, definitely not. Um, and she did it. She did. She did her thing. At least they had a little bit of a bloop going on them. It wasn't just like bloop like every single other person today. You know who you are. She did something. She pulled it together. She gave us a look. I appreciate that. I would rather see you with like a curtain bang. I don't know the side bang. I could do without. I could have left that in 2006. Eight, I don't know when that time period was, but I was alive for it and uh, it was a moment and it's not quite anymore. But you look beautiful. <laughs> stop, all of you, stop it. That was tragic, horrifying, really bad. Don't do it at home. 
kids or do it and learn from other people's mistakes. But anyways, if you want to check out my hair care line or my hair color line called X Mondo, you can do so with the links right down below or go to xmondohair.com. That's all for today. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to live your extra life and I'll see you next time. Bye.